The chronic back pain caused by a herniated disc can often leave a person feeling helpless and debilitated. Unlike more conventional procedures that require bone removal or the cutting of supporting spinal tissue, the MEN procedure, or minimally invasive endoscopic discectomy, utilizes an endoscope to access a small area of the spine without causing damage to the surrounding tissues. So there is no bone or muscle tissue removal during the procedure, which results in less discomfort, less recovery time, and patients do not need a fusion. The MEND procedure was developed to use a far lateral approach, accessing the disc herniation through the spine's natural opening. This allows for the removal of the disc herniation without disrupting any other tissue, so no bone or muscle is removed, which would further weaken the area. The procedure begins by inserting a guide wire laterally towards the spine until it reaches the disc herniation. Then, a tissue spreading dilator is placed over the guide wire and inserted down towards but not into the spine until it reaches the disc herniation. After the dilator has been inserted, a cannula or working channel is placed over the dilator. When the cannula is in place, a working channel is created to access the herniation. This herniation can then be accessed without resecting any bone or muscle. The cannula has a specially developed bevel or tip which protects the spinal nerve once it is inserted. After the working channel is in place, the herniation is approached using an endoscope. This endoscope essentially has three parts, a working hollow channel, a camera light source, and a drain. The endoscope is inserted into the cannula until it reaches the herniation. Then, a small gentle instrument is passed towards the herniation to assist in the herniation removal. For more information about the MEND procedure, visit our website at fastmd.com.